pepper. Now, we're all very familiar with the traditional pepper that comes from the Piper nigrum vine, but there is also an Australian native pepper. And this is a very interesting plant. Its botanical name is a Tasmania lanceolata, and it develops this little black berry that looks very like a standard black peppercorn. However, it is about five times hotter than the standard black pepper that you're used to. So it is one that does need to be used very sparingly. As well as having that very distinct pepper heat, it almost has a slightly minerally note, which does sound a little bit funny, but it goes very well with food that is very rich. It's excellent with game, uh, a, a long, uh, slow cooked stew, any of those dishes that are fairly rich, you'll find the Australian native black pepper will work beautifully. Now, if you really want to capture the aroma and flavour of the Australian bush, the same plant also gives us a leaf that we use in cooking. So the same plant we get the berry from, and we also get the Tasmanian pepper leaf. Now, this leaf is around about the same heat level as a standard black pepper. So if you're used to sprinkling a certain amount of black pepper onto a dish, you'd use about the same amount of the Australian native pepper leaf. The pepper leaf really does smell like the Australian bush. It's a lovely profile, has just enough heat, and is extremely versatile. So that's a plant that you really need to be enjoying.